my darlings! In this week's video I thought it would be fun to do some 1940s exercises. I've compiled these exercises from various places on the internet, from videos and from still pictures. So I'll link everything down below if you wanted to see those little videos individually. But I thought it would be neat to put it all together in one video so you guys can exercise at home with me. Alright, let's get into it! So to start off we're going to do some bust exercises and we're going to be doing some arm twists. For 20 times. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Now we're going to move into some backstroke, and this is very good for the arms and the shoulders. Keep doing this for a hundred strokes if you want. <laughs> Remember to go easy, don't go too fast. Back, come back, keep back, come back, come back. shake it out. <laughs> now we're going to do some arm crunches and this is very good for strengthening the bust muscles. This is very good for strengthening the pectoral muscles. And repeat this for about 20 to 30 times. Put your palms together girls and we're going to wiggle our arms out to open and then back 10 times. Oh, you can really feel this one. You can really feel it in the arms and across the shoulders and your chest. and shake it out. <laughs> All right, we're going to be laying down on the ground and lifting our legs up and scissoring our legs back and forth. Lifting your bottom up. We're going to do this 10 times, pushing our legs back and forth. Now we're going crisscross. And then back. <laughs> back and forth again. And do five more scissors. Now rolling onto our side for the next exercise. We're going to be meeting our arm and our foot together 10 times in the middle above us. One, two, three, four, five, six, ten. 
10. And now I'm gonna flip over and do the other side. And again, we're going to be meeting our arm and our foot together for 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, all right, now we're gonna come onto our hands and our knees and we're going to be lifting one leg at a time out to the back and extending it up like this. And not touching the ground when you come back down. Do this for about 15 times. Three. Alright, now we're going to come onto the other side and do the right leg as well. Girls, let's stand up for the next exercise. We're going to be swinging our leg back and forth, starting off small and gradually building up until it's in line with your hips. And getting smaller again, and then building up again. And if you feel like you're gonna lose your balance, make sure to hold on to something. Starting off small again, and then building up height until it gets to your hips again. All right, and now onto our other leg. Starting up small, building up. more, a little bit more, and then up to your hip height. And rest. Shake it up. All right, let's put our hands on our hips and we're going to be bouncing from left to right. And now we're going single, three, four, bounce, bounce, one, two, 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 three, four, and back up, shake it out. Okay, for the next exercise, we're going to be bringing our arms to the back and on our toes, and then back down to neutral. And then our arms out in front and on our toes, and back down. Up and down, and up, and down, 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 and then when we come up to the front, we're going to be coming down, keeping our arms out in front, and coming down onto our knees, and then slowly lowering back as far as we can hold. When you can't hold anymore, just swish your arms back and come in for a second time, coming back down and then swishing back up. 
shake it out. All right, for this next exercise, we're going to be lying on our backs. And you can either have your arms by your side or up above you. So you can have your arms down like this, or you can have your arms up here. Personally, I find it easier to have them up here to lift up your legs. So we're going to be lifting them up and then bringing them back down. And this helps to tighten up your abdominal muscles. You can hold on to something as well if you want. Hold on to some furniture. You can have your arms by your side like this. This is a little bit harder. All right, on to the next exercise. All right, for our next exercise, you can tuck your toes underneath a chair or a bed rail, and we're going to be bringing our right elbow to our left knee, and then our left elbow to our right knee. Two, three, Alright, in the same position with your feet tucked under, we're going to be gradually lowering back to resting and then coming back up. And then coming back up and then going back down to rest. And then coming back up and back down. And then coming back up. For this one, we're going to be laying down with our arms outstretched on the ground and our shoulder blades flat against the ground. We're going to bring our left leg over our right leg. We're going to be taking this down and around, crossing over our right leg, and then coming back up, and then back down again. We're gonna do this four more times. You should feel the pull in the back of your leg. Then we're gonna swap over and bring our right leg over our left and do the same thing again. We're gonna take it down over our left leg and up and around. You should really feel that pull in the back of your leg. It feels really good. back to resting. For this next one, we're going to be drawing our knees into our chest and we're going to be kicking it out and then bringing back to our chest and then kicking out and then bringing back in. This works your legs and your abdominal muscles. And your neck muscles. <laughs> Thank you all so much for joining in with me for doing these 1940s exercises. I had so much fun and I hope you had just as much fun as me. It was a really nice workout and if some of these exercises are too hard or they're hurting certain parts of your body, don't do it. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you next Sunday. Bye! Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, I can't hold myself up. <laughs> oh no. <sighs> Move into the backstroke. The backstroke. <laughs> oh. My nose is itchy. <laughs>